Welcome to the stage, co-drivers of the number 10 Velocity Worldwide Toshiba Corvette Daytona prototype, Jordan Taylor and Max Angelelli. And for a final time this evening, let's welcome back the very, very busy Richard Buck. Thank you. What a great evening this is. An evening of honoring our champions. It's my pleasure to present the 2013 Rolex Series DP Driver Championship trophies to Jordan Taylor and Max Angelelli. Nobody will understand me. No, they don't. Yeah. We know that. Okay. First, I would like to thank all our partners and uh, thanks to them if we're here. They allow us to be here, race. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> well, thanks. Stick to the script. Go on, it's gone. Okay. Okay. Thanks to Velocity Worldwide. Paul Blakely, Enda McShane, and Brian Stockman. Thanks to Toshiba. Chris Applegate. Thanks to Chevrolet. Jim Campbell, Mark Kent, and Mark Royce. Thanks to Dallara. Luca Bergianti. And then I would like to take uh, this opportunity to do something that I wanted to do a long time ago. Apologize. To, uh, no. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> to oh, everyone. <laughs> They love me. I have no problem it's, with it's that. A, it's a guilty laugh because no. everyone knows. No, they're, they're fine with me. No, Especially no, the not. team, right? Just say oh, sorry. Good. It's that easy. Uh, okay, then. No, no, no. Ryan Hunter, a poor guy. I mean, I'm afraid he might not have any kids anymore because Max didn't let him loose in the crotch belt of Daytona. He had some problem. <laughs> it was not my problem. It was his problem. Yeah, okay. I even, sh I even shake uh, Alex Gurney's Gern hands yesterday. Oh, yeah? yeah I did. Alex, I'm sorry, but he told me after that that he didn't wash his hands when he left the bathroom. So. But it was unintentional, very unintentional. unintentional, yes. Okay, we'll Carry move on. on from that. Carry on. Okay. It's your turn. I'd like to thank my mom and dad, and obviously Ricky as well. They, they gave us all the opportunities in the world, and uh, they're the reason we're here, literally. Um, thank you. I'm also proud that I've been able to grow up with my dad's hair as well, as you can see. Max is trying to show it off, but he doesn't have much left. Oh, here in the back. <laughs> it's receding a little bit on the front. He's growing it out to kind of a frontal comb over. <laughs> but uh, we'd like to give away two of my dad's biggest secrets in racing. I think, unfortunately, two big strategies. It's all about track position. Track position is key. If you are, if you first, you win the race. Yeah, basically, if you get out of the pits in the lead and, and you can maintain that position, you're basically in the best shape possible. <laughs> so, as soon as you, but he has another strategy where if you're behind a car, you just stay behind him, and then you get closer, 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 you pull out, and then you just go right on by him. <laughs> and I think in his days away from the race car, he's kind of forgot what it's been like to be a driver. Maybe in the 70s, 80s, it was yeah. a little different, but. Uh, years ago. <laughs> It's not that easy to make passes these days. Yeah. Things has changed way. Big time. <laughs> okay, it's me. Well, this is a, a real team championship. Uh, our team, Wintero Racing, uh, delivered an outstanding performance. Pit stops. Yeah, strategy. Strategy. Preparation. They put us always in P1 and uh, all our five wins. We just, that yeah. was it. I think they always tell us, pretty mean, but... Uh, I think we only passed about two cars on track in the five races that we won. And it's some stupid statistic that we passed them all on pit lane or something. And I think they're trying yeah. to take all the credit, but uh, we're pretty proud of it too. But uh, I mean, we won the driver's championship, um, but I think for us, it was all down to the team this year and all thanks goes to them. Thanks guys, all you. And my dad, dad's sponsorship. Last but not least, I want to say something about Wayne Taylor, a true champion. 
He always wins his championship every single year. He raised the money for us to go racing. He never failed. He never failed, and I'm sure he will never fail. Thank you, Wayne. Thank you. Tonight has been a showcase for a premium series and a premium brand, bonded by history.